Previously on Nexomon Extinction. There are three basic requirements to become a Grandmaster. You must be a Gold Tamer. You must have a reputation of 600. And you must pass the Combat Challenge. The only requirement left is the Combat Challenge. Shit. Alright. <laughs> you are officially a Grandmaster of the Guild. You will plan Amelie's downfall and the absolute destruction of Vados at the Orphanage. Yes, there's one more thing you need to do. You must go and speak with Vados. All that remains is for you to, to distract him. You grew up in a human orphanage, didn't you? That place was once my home as well. Your time is up. Side bomb. Okay. No! Episode 38, The King of Monsters. Hey! That's uh, the OG, Gooey. Hello, Dewey. Atlas. It's the ghost from back then. I have come to thank you, Dewey. You are about to set things right. The things that I ruined when I defeated Omnicron centuries ago. I... I knew what I had, to, what I had done. To save my present, I chose to destroy your future, Dewey. Yeah. In the grand scheme of things, was Omnicron's downfall truly for the good of our world? Why are you telling us this? Because you are no different than me, Dewey. You are following my very own footsteps right now. You are about to destroy Vados, are you not? He is the imminent threat, just like Omnicron was millennia ago. Heed my words, my friend. What you are about to do will forever change the course of humanity. You will become the king of monsters and rule for an eternity to come. That's a long time. Better or for worse. Eh, well... You gotta do what you gotta do, huh? Do we have a choice? Fossil will hunt us down sooner or later. Of course, we have to fight him. <sighs> Alright. Oh shit, where's Amelie at? I've been expecting you for a long time, Dewey. Quite the honor to meet the King of Monsters himself. Dewey, he knows your identity! Yes, I know exactly who and what you are, child of Nara. I can see through your clever human guys. I can see the vile and unsightly corruption that lies underneath your skin. Corruption? You're the aberration here. You're not even an actual Nexomon, jerk. Deal. Huh. Yes, indeed. For better or for worse, I am not a true Nexomon. The Nexomon are a humiliating disease. They devastated our dearest planet with their barbaric war. The Nexomon are a wicked curse. The poor humans cower in fear behind tall walls and false hopes. The Nexomon are a vicious scourge. They are the culmination of everything that is wrong in our lives. And you, Dewey, are the despicable king of such scum. Damn, I'm the king of scum? Ugh. I thought I was king of some cool shit. Guess I'm just king of scum. Fuck. Listen to me, and listen well, Dewey. I was created to protect mankind at all costs. To protect it, I will. By eradicating the vulgar blight known as Nexomon. Your very existence. I cannot allow it. Disappear with a smile, knowing that this world is set towards a brighter tomorrow. Be gone. He's hit me with a flashbang! Not cool, man. He hurt Coco. Motherfucker. Oof. What the heck happened here? We heard a huge explosion just now. Hey, Dewey, wake up! Did... Did Vados attack Dewey? What? Why? This can't be. Goodness. Is this lad okay? Owner, what did we do to upset Vado so much? I'm just a, a king of the scum. I don't know. He was disgusted. Stay away from him. Tamers of the guild. Ah, fuck. Oh, there you are. Dewey is far more dangerous than you think. Explain yourself, Amelie. 
Yeah, this ain't right one way or another. No, I don't think that you want to hear. You, you just attacked one of your tamers. Fine. Dewey is a tyrant in disguise. That's all there's to it, really. But I'm... But I'm... I'm a cool guy. Uh, no. Tyrant, just because just I'm a tyrant doesn't mean I'm a bad guy. Dewey, a tyrant? Is this a joke? Can next someone disguise themselves as humans? No. That's not possible. Whenever a dragon attacked humans, Dewey was in the crowd. The dragon outbreak from 15 years ago? Right when Dewey was born. And now, Vados himself has acknowledged Dewey as a tyrant. It is in plain sight. This foul monster deceived us all. So please, step inside. Step aside. Let Vados end this for once and for all. Damn, what are they gonna do? Those are my friends. No. I... I don't think so. Huh? Of all people, I didn't think that you'd... And Ross, Ross hit puberty. He's ready to throw down. All right. You'll regret this, Ross. Get lost. Get lost. Oh, shit. I have not fought this guy. That's quite enough. All of you. It's Edward. Tamers of the guild. Open your eyes. The very thing that you have sworn to destroy lies right under your feet. There is a dangerous tyrant among us. He has deceived us since the day he was born. A traitor. You want us to hand over Dewey? What we are doing is for the sake of our people. Nothing else matters. <laughs> Man, we can't do that. That's our friend. No. It's just a Nexomon. Nexomon are a plague. They are the spawn of the evil king, Omnicron. They are the reason we live in this dying world. But now, with Vados, we can defeat those vile creatures. Heed my words and come to your senses. You shall abandon the tyrant, Dewey, Dewey, or you will perish with him. I don't know, man. We'll see about that. Damn. Are you sure about this plan? Perhaps Dewey will come to trust humans. But no human in their right mind would ever trust a tyrant. The day will surely come when mankind turns against Dewey. So, tell me, Dina. Who will stand up in your son's darkest hour? <gasps> These tamer dudes! They're actually my friends! Mameli, you go with Vados. I will hold the line against the traitors! I cannot believe any of this. How cruel of fate. Fall now, King Dewey. But fall knowing that I will despise every second of this. Come on, there's five other people. Can't they just fight you for me? Oh, look at you, dude. You got a common ant lorm. Yeah. Well, Everest. Oh, no. Don't be doing none of that, boy. It's, uh... I don't want you buffing yourself up, man. Alright, let's try to confuse this guy. Doesn't seem to have any good attacks, so... That's kind of good. Just get confused. He must have some items that prevent the status condition changes. Alright, water. Snarf. Easy decision here. Snarf, our guy. This Mirage move kind of kicks ass, honestly. Fuck yeah. Eh, well. Do another Electro Bomb. Alright, Shardberg, we just threw down with one of you. Alright. Yep, we got the play here. Electric bomb. Missed twice. And I am out of stamina. Shit. What is that? I don't know what he just did to me. I better heal. 
Better not be getting too ahead of myself here thinking I can do whatever the hell I want. Better heal. Mirage again. Couple electric bombs and call it a day here with the Shardberg. Alright, dude. 111 damage. Oh, dude. Solace. This guy looks cool. We're gonna supercharge. Hell yeah, dude. You fucking suck. Oh, shit. We're good. Start off, you're good. 53. Let's hit a Mirage. We're supercharged twice. Damn, bro. We need to dodge. 139, dude. Alright, this supercharged shit, it works good. That supercharged shit's incredible. Alright, we're still supercharged. Dude, I can nuke them. Alright. Uh, go black. I might actually switch out on. There goes our supercharge, I guess. Pretty sure it goes away. God dang it, dude. Paralyzed, man. Alright, I need to... Need some more health in my life here. Alright, this freaking stupid cat thing. Not afraid of this guy. So what's he got left? Cat guy, electric guy... And probably something pretty good. One more attack, man. One more drill on this fool. Okay, we're fine. We bring bringing back out. Okay, Goldblatt. Gotta heal Everest, man. Wow, dude, why do you do that? Oh, Fire Guy. Forgot about this guy. This guy sucks. I should probably heal up the rest of my team. While, uh... While we got this guy out, because this guy... Nothing to be afraid of. Yep, we're looking pretty solid now. This guy sucks. Big time. I'm doing like 20 damage, man. Come on. 48? Eh, we're still fine. We're still fine. Shit. Okay, okay. I see what you're working with. I'm gonna heal. Shit, probably should have got some of my stamina back. Yeah, should have got my stamina back. Alright, dude, please die. Please die, Mr. Edward. I do appreciate this guy for pardoning me back in the day and let me, uh, not be a renegade. That was nice of him. Alright, man, we're going up some levels here. Increases attack damage by 25%, but deals 15% of damage dealt to opponent back to this... Wait. Deals 15% damage dealt to opponent back... No! No. I'll get myself killed if I do that. I will die. Sorry, dude. I had to fuck you up. Basically, my friends were just here to watch me whoop, whoop that guy's ass. Well, shouldn't we be heading towards Vados? You guys go ahead. <laughs> the guild was built to serve both humans and Nexomon. It is clear that they strayed from their path long ago. What about you guys? Heck yeah. No more secrets from now on, do we? Whatever lies ahead, we will confront it as one. Who cares if my pal Dewey is a Nexomon? The guy saved us back then. I am repaying this debt. Let's roll. Cool, man. Lead the way, Dewey. We've got your back. Alright. I guess we're just... Just gonna haul ass up there. Fuck. I wanted to heal. 
Whoa, whoa, whoa! So this is what Vados looks like up close. Shit's kind of spooky, huh? He's just standing in a rift. Dewey, you wretched king of monsters. I see that you have led these poor tamers astray. How deplorable. How cowardly. I thought that you were better than this. But your efforts are for naught, Dewey. The tamers of the guild support my existence. The citizens of Parham encourage my mission. The children of this world rely upon my triumph. But you... What do you have, Dewey? A ragtag team of traitors? A gang of useless tyrants? A feeble handful of Nexomon slaves? Is that all you have, Dewey? Is this how your final stand shall be? We have an airship. Huh? What did you say? An airship? <laughs> that was pretty cool, actually. Oh, shit! Oh my god! I had a nightmare of this happening one time. Are they sending them up into the stratosphere? They sending them to the moon? God damn. That was pretty cool. What the heck was that? What did you guys do? An airship. You, you guys plan to hit Vados with an airship? Yes. That is messed up! Perhaps. Does that mean that we just finished the game? Yep, that was everything. Vados has been defeated. Let the credits roll. I've won? Stop, stop! Put the credits, morons. Damn it! I can still lose. <laughs> what is wrong with you guys? This isn't over yet, you buffoons. What? The plan was just to distract him, wasn't it? The airship will drag him far away so the tyrants can defeat him. Otis is gonna wreck the airship before it gets there, fool. You gotta weaken him first or the ambush won't be successful. Now hold on tight, alright? I will warp all of you into the airship. Oh, fuck. I don't want to be in the same airship as Vado. Stop. Well, at least everyone's coming with me. Well, here we go. Let's talk to this guy real quick. Oh, Dewey. This is it, isn't it? The end game, as they call it. The path ahead is full of hardships. Perhaps this is just a bad dream. Perhaps you can wake up from it. What the fuck? No, we're staying here. Are you crazy? I'm not about to just return back. Why are these guys all conked out everywhere? Oh! I don't know why that scared me. That shit always happens on this game. Shit. Oh boy! I'm coming! I have to use all my abilities. Oh shit. Let's go to the deck. Got no other option, do I? Damn. Oh man! Coco's about to get teabagged. Observe, Dewey. Destroy me, you have doomed all of your friends. And when he ought to suffer until your wickedness is quenched. Oh, vile king of monsters. On this day, I swear to you. This burning airship under our feet. <laughs> Shall be your tomb. Well, here we go, guys. 992 health. Seems a bit extreme, don't you think? See how Water Wings does. 28 damage? He did 28 damage? Vados. The Nuker of Worlds. Just did 20. What the fuck? What was that? Oh, he's fire now, dude. Oh, this is this is good actually. 
I'm perfectly fine with this. Oh shit, 92 is a lot still though. Alright, I gotta make sure everyone's healthy because we're gonna be s switching around. Like, prop water? Alright, well, let's try to freeze them. Best I can do. Let's see, how many turns does he have this element? That's two turns so far. Three. 69, bro? You really hit me with the 69? Alright, oh my god, dude, miss. Alright, well, we're gonna use Starf while he's wind. 74? Oh my goodness, bro. Oh my god. He's miss. Good news is we've taken down more stamina than his uh, health. All right, well, fuck it. I'll let you bomb you. All right, seventy-four on his electro bomb. Seventy. Oh my goodness. Plant. Oh, it's called plant, not not leaf or grass. Well. Whatever it is, I gotta... Gotta counter for it. Damn. Hits for 71, though. Alright. I don't think there's any point in me trying to buff myself, because I have to keep on switching. I should make sure I do all my debuffs on him, though. You know? Oh, God. Alright, Ryu. I'm gonna take Ryu, uh... Okay. Impellet, power up. Need to heal my guys. Need to heal. 23, it's nothing to worry about. Water wings, Tom Brady. Need to heal them as well. Alright, we're looking good. Just Ryu's getting weak here. Uh, go oh, he's back to Ghost. Okay. Well, you know what? I think Water Wings was good because he goes Ghost to Fire. Holy crap, dude. That's big damage. I think he can kill me right now. If he attacks me with his good attack, he could kill me. 85... Another 85, no. This is fine. Fifty-one, okay, that's fine. Alright, he's like a he's like a no oh my god, no 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 no! Oh my god, I thought we were gonna burn right there. Thought we were done. I actually got scared. Drop the electro bomb, baby. That's fine, that's fine. I should also heal up Water Wings. Fuck yeah, Snarf. So proud of you, dude. 75, bro. 75, bro. Jesus, man. I need to dodge. Alright. Just dodge is shit. Yeah. Good snarf. Double good snarf. Triple good snarf. Alright, I'm probably gonna get hit now. Oh, baby. Alright, well, it's about time we get the hell up on out of there. Alright, just a couple of sun cores, baby. We can end this guy. Or something, I don't know. 
Oh, what the fuck? What's that all about? You just heal. Oh. You leave Coco alone, man. So sad. So futile. So hopeless. Your time is running out, King of Monsters. Despite your every effort, I am still standing tall and proud. I will never falter in the face of evil, ever. Open your eyes, Dewey, and watch very carefully. Watch as your legacy burns in my wake. This will be my victory. What do you think you're doing, Dewey? We give you our powers. Exactly for this moment. Oh yeah, I forgot to use them. <laughs> the fire to scorch any foe. The wings to overcome all hardships. Breath to soothe all evil. The spark to inspire all allies. You have it all, do we? Rise up. Rise up, King of Monsters. Oh, okay. Oh shit! I did it! I turned into an Omnicron. Long, long ago, in a burning skyward battlefield, the foretold King of Monsters was reborn. On the day of reckoning, Dewey walks towards the face of extinction to forge the future of our world. This is the story of the invincible Tyrant of Light. That's me. Shit, man. Listen to my oath, Dewey. As long as I draw breath, you will never walk on the planet below again. By my own two hands, you will never walk among humans again. Bear witness to my final stand, King of Monsters. Bear witness to the end of your brethren. Bear witness. We're brighter tomorrow. Now that the King of Monsters has risen, will Dewey have what it takes to take on Vados? Find out next time on Nexomon Extinction.